just gonna have to see. This part's pretty nice, actually. So instead of having to unfreeze it, you can just go ahead and shoot him down. Just like you did how to get to the mountains, actually. Because you had to shoot it down. I don't think the red ruby ones you need to get. Maybe you do. I don't know. Whoa! Guys, that was close. Ow! That hurt. <laughs> wow, guys. Ice Glacier is super effective. No, it's not. Did you hear that? Did you hear that, guys? That was so cool. Oh my god, that was epic. I'm loving these headphones. That was sweet. Did you hear that? I don't know if you heard that. That was freaking epic. I heard like this awesome bass line. It was so oh my It was so cool. Wow, that was really sweet. That was I loved it. Oh, oh. That was beautiful. That was just beautiful, you know? I'm really impressed. That was that actually I mean I'm, I love these headphones. I hear so much stuff I didn't hear before. It's amazing. Um, one thing I forgot to mention, all I mean I forget to mention, it's just, it's a thing I can mention, you know, so I, I just can, but anyway, um, the thing about this game compared to Ocarina of Time is that there aren't nearly as many keys within the dungeons, you know, I think the last one, how many keys did it have, one, two, I mean, yeah, that's like, this one, I'm on my second one, but you know, there might be three in total, maybe, there's just not as many keys, and so you're not looking around, you're not constantly trapped and constantly have to look back. So, shoot. What's going on? There's bows. There's bows. They're going to kill me. They're down there, but they're going to kill... Oh, my God. So, we'll go kill them, and then I'll get my stray fairy. It's in here. And I believe this was the room for the last stray fairy. So... Like, like this is like one of the first time I went through this. I'm like, oh! Okay. Okay. Now... Because I didn't wear it through, like, I, and I finally, like, you know, wore it in this room. So, oh, okay, you might want to. Okay, let's try it. Yeah! We got it! Yeah, we got it, guys. We didn't need those stupid lenses of truth. Okay. Okay. You, you can. Listen. Ah! I was talking over it. Should have heard that epic bass on. Okay, what the hell, fairy? Oh, I hate it when they do that. So this actually is a pretty interesting puzzle, to be honest. It is pretty... It's pretty epic, so... I mean, you could just skip it once you get the... <coughs> item. Whatever that is. But, you know. Huh, Tattle, what do you want to tell me? What, you think you push down something this big just by standing on top of it? You're gonna have to find some way to pound it down. I know. It's like... I never said I this is I can I think I can get it. I never said that. Okay. What's your freaking deal? Okay, so here's what you want to do. I think this part maybe this one looks the few times where you want to have both ma masks on the other C's because you're not going to be using any items. You're just going to be using masks. So this is all timed, guys. So you might want to pay attention. Oh, at least this part is. Wait. Do I need to stomp this? I don't know. Oh, I know what the- yeah, I know. Oh, you idiot. I know what I needed to stomp. I know what I needed to stomp. Oh my god. I needed to stomp this one here. And then use that one and then- Yeah. 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 Wait, wait, no, no. That one, then the other one I was just standing on. Okay, do you got that? She's an idiot. So stupid! Yes! And then I'll open that one right there. Take off the mask, get on the bunny hood, and run like crazy. Because that's what it's all about. It's all about. Yes, and now we are up. On the next floor. Oh, don't. Oh, actually, you do want to do that. Thank you. Thank you. Put my arrows on because that's. I'm not gonna be using a mask on the other one. And because this is ice, you can just simply. Yeah. Get to the other side. K. 
get to the other side. And yeah, sometimes, usually, um, like, earlier floors, lower floors, they'll have this. So if you fall off, you just go right there, and then you have the ladder, and you can go back. But there's one part where they don't, they don't have that. You just gotta go around and be a man. You just, is it there? Yeah. You just, yeah, because, I mean, you kind of have to get used to it, but... If you fall, you fall, and you... Like, you suck. No, you don't suck, you just screwed up. And you gotta try again. And you can push through, and I know you can do it. I know you can do it. Is there a treasure chest up there? Damn. Oh, I know how I get that. I usually fall. It's kind of tough to get that, though. And it wastes a lot of time, but... So, yeah. It's kind of tough. To be honest, that part. But, if you can pull through, I know you can do it. Um, going here now? I wonder what this is. Am I going into a dead end? I know what it is! Haha! I know it. No, do I? Oh, the treasure chest on a weird side. I don't think I do. I don't know what I'm doing, guys. What room is this? Shoot. What room is this? Ah! Uh, I was thinking of a different room. Silly me. Get out of here! Nobody wants you! Huh. Ah, oh my god. Wow, that's freaking cool. Okay, you know what? I'm not gonna do this yet because, yeah, I'll tell you what, because, um, because once, if we go to the room on the other side, we'll be able to get <coughs> something that'll be able to get that switch, and then I'll move that platform up, so in the case of if I fall, because there's actually treasure chests up there, that's a fairy net, and if I fall, I screw up, yeah. Oh, and if you're wondering how, like, how the hell do you even get up there? Yeah, I told you so. So, any questions? Yeah. So we're just gonna see what glorious thing we could possibly see. Yeah, Cause yeah, we went around, now we can go across again. So that means we went to all four sides of this floor, so that's good. That's a good thing. Although we actually didn't go to the one on that, on that's my right right now, but we will. We're gonna continue upward. Upward. I remember this upward, yeah. It's uh like a basketball thing. Uh, I remember that. Yep. Those were some okay times. I'm. I don't know. I was more into sports when I was young. I don't know. So okay, so there's a little trick with this guy. Okay, if you have the compass and you see that red arrow there, once he pops up, you just shoot. Now you're like, oh well, this is still pretty easy because it's there. He's that right there. And, he, and also, also, Navi flies to him. Navi flies to him. But, okay, so first you're thinking, okay, well, this is really easy. Watch this. He's going around every... Now watch, during the cutscene, did you see the one Navi just went to? And if you also notice, that red one right there, that's the real one. You always look at the red dot on the screen. And Navi will always go to it. So actually, to be honest, this is probably like a really easy boss fight, actually. You just gotta pay attention to that red dot. If you have the compass, you're okay. Maybe you don't even need it. But yeah. If you didn't pay attention to it, that it is actually kind of a tough boss. But So, you know. What's this item gonna be? Oh boy. Oh boy. What's it gonna be? Oh boy. What's it gonna be? <gasps> the fire arrow! Oh, oh. Wow. Okay. Oh, jeez. Ah. Oh my gosh, are you serious, dude? Wow, okay. <laughs> Who would've... This song is bad. Uh, hey, hello, man! You take your pills today? No, I do not like this. And who is this? Julie Diamond. Julie... <laughs> Julie Diamond? That's what they're calling this? You just put out some serious BS. <laughs> It's bad. It's really, really bad. Yeah, that's that's a reference. If any of you get that, I love you. Although, if you don't, I still love you. That's, I still love you anyway, guys. I'm not saying I don't love you just because you don't might not get a reference. It's just I know I love you. If that's actually that's not true, I could still really, really freaking hate you. So okay, this part, take off your bunny hood. Take it off because these platforms are tiny. You just hold forward. Take, yeah, you take off your bunny hood, or you are screwed. Shoot! Ah! Ah! Ah, I screwed it up. I shrewded it. 
Oh yeah, you hear shrewd? It's just a new term they use in the office now. It's shrewd. He just shrewded it up. You know, yeah. <laughs> and yes, that is actually a reference to the office, by the way. It's from the office. So look. Oh, fire arrows. Whoa. And look, it also gets a switch. Blink. Yeah. Did you hear that baseline? Did you hear that? It's it's re it's reoccurring because that's that's what they do in video games. Usually. They don't just have this one huge long song that goes on and on and on and on forever. They usually repeat it. Yeah, because that that'd be pretty tough to do. I think there's one more. You gotta turn this way. I'm right. Yeah, I didn't even need that. That's how cool I am. Yeah, see, that's why I didn't wanna. I didn't wanna go here before I got the fire arrows. So you know. So now we don't even need to go back because this is the only way you can go to right now. It's the only way. It's the only. It's the only way. Yeah. <laughs> My friend and I say that a lot. It's like, no, no, we can't do that. We gotta do something else. It's like it's always something illogical. It's just like it doesn't make any sense. Like it's the only way, guys. It's the only way. And just sit there and smile, saying it's the only way. Okay, that's weird. Where is? There it is. So here's what I do. You just get to like this corner, and you fall and you pray. Does that sound cool? I can't even see it. But where is it? Get your lens of truth on. That should. Shut sure, uh! up! Wait, hey, you know what? You know what? I hey, hey, you know what I can do now? I can do this. Hey, <laughs> that's how I said it. Hey, you know what I can do now? Hey, what's this right here? So I don't know if you've ever noticed this. You probably have, but yeah. So this is like the only time you like one. Of, actually, one of the few times you use a Deku in this game in this dungeon. Did you hear that baseline? Ah, oh, I love it so much. Ah, oh, man, that is great stuff. That just makes me so happy. I'm so glad I can wear headphones while playing my my L when I'm LPing my games now instead of just having to, you know, something through a crappy TV or a headset. I'm so glad. I can. Ah, this makes everything so much more cool. Okay, so now, as you probably have guessed, not only can we unfreeze these, but we can also get those other guys in one shot. Yeah. Suck it. Let's get to these arrows, because I'm... Shoot! Ah! 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 Okay. That was really scary. That was really scary, guys. And I almost didn't get it. Don't worry, there's magic over there. It's okay. There's magic over there. We can get it in the pots. Ah, yeah. Ah, yeah, nice. Nice, and arrows, and there's still arrows from the guys killed. Nice. 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 So I don't want to go in that one door yet. I think I still want to be going up. Even though, yeah, I'm still going to just try to get that fairy. And yeah, because there's one, there's going to be one part where you're going to have to push the switch and make the whole center of like that circular part go up and that's that's where it gets kind of confusing then you go up and you realize oh shoot I should have done that yet I should have done this thing and then I should you know and you're like ah! like shaking your fist and now you're like no nah! that's what happens a lot so how are you doing so now with the fire arrows you can shit on your pants Yes, uh, as I was saying, with the fire arrows, you can go ahead and continue upward. I just fell down and I. I just kind of. Uh, my mouth slipped. No, oh, yeah. Anything is possible. You just gotta believe. That reference is to the SpongeBob SquarePants movie. When she gave him mustaches. Does. Leave mustaches? Like, like, like this. Like you just, you're a man. Like you just gotta believe. It's this, it's that line. You just gotta believe. Whatever her name is, man. 
there's a game on Nickelodeon.com. I don't know if it's still there. There's like there's a few games actually. 3D SpongeBob games. There's the one like the it's based off the SpongeBob SquarePants movie, but it was like it was the game. And uh, you just rode around and, I, and you could do so much. That was a huge game. That was a big game. Ah, uh, such nostalgia. Yeah, some computer games bring me nostalgia. It's weird. Usually uh, people say like, "It's all good Nintendo times and so." I'm like a lot of computer games give me nostalgia. Just remember them, Jackie? Um, no, what is it? Samurai Jack. Yeah. Those are some great computer games. Oh, there were some good ones. There was one though. A new. There's like a newer one. I mean, obviously they're all old now, probably. But um, there was one where you had to like destroy the evil pop machines. But no, no, no not pop. baseline. Okay, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna do that anymore, guys. I'm sorry. It's me being stupid. I'm sorry. But um, it's like not, not like pop. Like pop is in the genre. Pop, like, like hip hop. Like they're listening to hip hop. All these people are like, like you know, like floating towards it. They're like, whoa, what's this awesome music? And he's like, no, it's not awesome. It's like he's trying to save them from because it's, like, it's just like this bad guy who has all of these. Amps, amps. I don't, why didn't I think of that? Amps, the pop machines, guys. He's trying to destroy the evil pop machines. No, he's not. Okay, I see it now. Actually, it might be a good thing. To... Yes, I made it. Okay, good. So yeah, just for safe, safe, just for safe measures, just for safe measures, you might want to have your lens of truth on while doing that. But there you go. Use another straight fairy. A little risky, but it's it's worth it. It's worth it. Wait, which one do you want to go to? Is it this one? I mean, it really doesn't matter. I don't think it would be this one, because that's... No, no, we don't want that. But it was a Samurai Jack computer game. Destroying all these amps that were generating, like, all the music and stuff. And it's like, like, people would... Like, those people were dancing in the clubs. And, like, you're in your karate suit. Or, like, you know, he's like a samurai, but he's wearing white. Like, a white robe, black belt, so it's kind of like karate. But, <laughs> you know, and people are just, they're just dancing away, and you just gotta, like, you punch them, I think, or you, or do you, do you, do you size them with your sword? That would be violent, huh? I don't mention Cartoon Network games. Yeah. Just smashing evil citizens, because, oh, I think maybe, yeah, there might be, um, yeah, I think there is something, like, because you don't want to actually hurt the people. Oh, yeah, you punch them, and they just fall off the screen. They just, like, fall off, you know, you know, you know how it's, like, all 2D and stuff. Shoot, it's not the first day. Actually, I don't really care because I have plenty of time. But you know, I just follow. You know, because you don't want to do that to much people because you don't want to hurt them. They're just innocent people. But you might have to. So you like you lose points and stuff. Shoot. Ah, oh, thank God. Okay. See that? That's one for instance where you don't f up basically. Where's the key? 